Make all the jokes you want about it, but for Sarah Dickinson, the topic is no laughing matter. In fact, it's pretty personal. Some of my friends' parents have had breast cancer. I've had family that has had breast cancer. My grandmother, aunts have had it. It's just, it's very much ingrained in my life. Around her sophomore year at the Nathan Hale Ray High School in East Haddam, Sarah began wearing this bracelet with its rather creative slogan. The bracelet is part of the Keep a Breast Foundation's cancer awareness campaign, and it's designed to get young people thinking about breast cancer. The reason that it says I heart boobies is because they know it's going to attract adolescent attention, and that's the point. They want adolescents to be aware of what's happening, especially the young young girls. And the bracelet definitely turned some heads. In fact, administrators asked Sarah not to wear the bracelet because it was creating what they say was a disturbance. It was never ever the cause or the breast cancer that was at, at the root of the, the problem. Again, it was students being less mature or a little bit you know, silly about it and, and, and being disruptive or at least a distraction. So Sarah, feeling her free speech rights were being infringed upon, did what any high school teenager would do in this situation. She contacted the ACLU. The civil rights group talked to the school district and more than a year and a half later, administrators decided the bracelet could stay. It's not legal precedent, but it's an important message uh, for students and administrators that students don't waive their free speech rights when they go on to school. The bracelet did make a comeback about two weeks ago, and for this college-bound senior, an invaluable lesson was learned. You absolutely always have to stand up for what you believe in, because if you don't stand up for what you believe in, what are you really going to stand up for then? And it's, it is for a bigger cause, because this affects everyone.